I've got a Samsung front loading washing machine here and I've got a leaky um, filter. We wanted to clean it out and so we took it apart and cleaned out the gunk real good and now we're trying to put it back in and it keeps leaking. The seal keeps leaking. This o-ring's not nesting properly and it continues to leak on us. Um, this thing is a real bear. What I'm what I've discovered is that there is a little bit of a I don't know if you call this an arrow or just a little bit of a, a little bit of a mark here at the very center top. And we have a mark on the filter itself too. A little square piece that sticks out. Those need to be lined up when you push it in and start the twisting. If they're not lined up, you're going to continue to get leaking. So we've got a towel here to gather up all the water that's been leaking out of it. We tried it a couple different times now. I had the same trouble in the past. Um, yeah, even, even this here is kind of chewed up from the tools we've been using to force it in there. You have to push in extremely hard to get this thing in or out. It's... I don't know why they made it like this. I guess it's childproof. I don't know why you'd even have to make this childproof. There's a door here blocking access to this. Anyways, um, hopefully that helps some people. That tip, you got to line them up and then push in with all you got and then turn it clockwise. And once it clicks um, like a medicine bottle, uh, child proof cap then you know you got it tight and then you can stop and then give it a try and hopefully that works a couple other notes on this that really made sense to me when I got this in the right way this little guy here it spins independently of this outer ring so you put them in this can actually come apart from the other one but it's kind of confusing but this needs to be set in this needs to be set in. So when you push it in, you got to really crank it in, in, push in hard, and then turn so this gets in and this gets snug. Because this gasket that sits in here, this seal, rubber seal, has got to be seated all the way in. And then when that's all the way in, it will stop. And this thing will keep on clicking. It doesn't really matter. But that's how you know you got it, is when this outer ring here um, doesn't move anymore. After uh, several attempts, we finally figured that part out. Hope this helps.